we all know it. Learning can happen all kinds of ways in a classroom. And for some of these students in Santa Ana, books and bots go hand in hand. NBC4's Hetty Chang is live in Santa Ana to tell us about a unique program. Hetty. Yeah, Annabelle, this is such a cool program where parents and kids are sitting side by side in the classroom learning all about robotics and coding. This program is being offered at Magnolia Science Academy where 85% of the students are Latino and underserved. Every Wednesday morning at Magnolia Science Academy in Santa Ana. Parents skip the morning drop-off and instead head into the classroom with their kids. Let's keep trying. Let's keep and here, instead of reading and books, it's robots and blocks. We have to put something here. Families work together on critical thinking and problem solving using the robots they coded and built, each tiny piece by piece, and there are many. 200. 200. Over 200. Just ask 11 year old Ovid Ortiz who shows us what his robot can do. Move these two to go forward, move okay. this one to go um, right, and this one to go left. What's frightening me most is that how such a little thing can do a lot. All controls coded by Ovid, his six year old sister. Because it's fun to build and it's fun to drive too. And their parents. For me, it's like, oh, it's only for kids, so I'm not a good fan of Legos or anything like that. But, um, you know, now that I'm in this class, it's like we're, we're enjoying it. Um, I'm learning about coding, and I didn't have any clue about coding until now. The program is the only one of its kind in Orange County, offered free to families. It's not just about building bots, but also bonds. When they're working on the robots, they can stay there for hours, and they don't want to leave. Uh, and you see that how they're focused, instead of working, uh, instead of just playing on phones, they're Working on robots. The kids are so connected with these robots they built. Well, Obit named his Bob. Brilliant, outstanding Bob. That's what it stands for. Kind of describes the kids who built them too. Obid tells us he wants to be an engineer for NASA someday, and we don't doubt it. Live in Santa Ana, Hetty Chang, NBC4 News. What a great program. Thanks, Hetty.